big challenge in that regard is getting Americans to see that it must consider itself as a global citizen uh, and that it is, it is both ethically required for the U.S. to uh, try to create an international order which is just and fair and um, to, to, to go there it must respect other countries. The U.S. must resume the position of a player in, in, in the, the family of nations uh, and we need to have a conversation about that. So, um, so that means that the U.S. must support a just international economic order in particular, okay, and, which it is not now doing. Okay. Um, so we need to have a conversation about what a just international economic order would look like um, and uh, try to have a, a political discussion of those issues. Uh, we're, we're a very long way away from doing that. That sort of really basic, obvious thing. We're still we're a very long way from having a conversation about what a, a just economic international order would look like and what the role of nation states would be in that. And it wouldn't require some international taxation, I think, of strong global environmental laws, of reform of the, the trade regimes, and other things. So, um, so the way we get there, I think, is through social movements that enlarge the political discourse about these issues. Uh, so we need social movements to open up Americans to these obvious questions, as I see.